So today, guys, we are covering a story from Sheffield about a gang of five men were jailed for their parts in a plot to cut and distribute heroin, cocaine and crack worth a stunning £125 million. Ringleader Mohammed Zulfikar, also known as Zully, a previously convicted heroin dealer, was sentenced to 24 years after a court heard he had begun the operation while still in prison. His associates, Adnan Lal, Mohammed Ishak, Mohammed Faizan and Haider Ali were jailed for 18 years, 16 years, 12 years and 12 years respectively. Such was the fear they inspired. Key witnesses would only testify in the trial after emigrating away from the UK. Sheffield Crown Court heard that the men set up their operation in a rented flat in a leafy suburb of that city, where they cut heroin and cocaine and produced crack cocaine on an industrial scale. When officers raided the property, they found leftover kilos of cocaine and heroin with an estimated street value of about £300,000, as well as cutting agents and equipment to support a drugs preparation factory. Investigations revealed the men had begun working in April 2010 and over five months would have produced Class A drugs with a street value of a staggering £125 million. As he handed down the punitive sentences, with police officers flanking the courtroom for security, Judge Peter Kelson QC called the plot a professional operation that produced drugs on a massive scale. This was Class A drug supply on a massive scale and bigger than most cases I have seen come through South Yorkshire, the judge said. Ringleader Zully started running the operation while serving a six and a half year prison sentence for dealing heroin. Zully had intentionally chosen people he knew and trusted, but most importantly, did not have criminal records, to be foot soldiers and workers in the operation. The flat was rented by Faison, who later told police it had been his chill pad, despite there being no evidence of entertainment or essentials in the property. Neighbours told police that within weeks of him moving in, they began hearing strange, industrial-type noises and regularly saw several Asian men coming and going. When police raided the property in September 2010, Zulfikar was there, and shortly afterwards, Lal arrived. Further investigations led police to two more members of the group, Ishak and Ali. A long and complex two-year police investigation followed, and the five men were arrested in April 2012. All were charged with conspiracy to produce and supply Class A drugs. The gang was jailed for a total of 82 years. 